Welcome back to Fallout. Here we are, Mike Tyson, who has now morphed into a uh, Iron Man, sort of Power Ranger type looking person. We should be good. I mean, we got everything now. We've got power armor. Uh, we've got our power fist with a ton of ammo. We've got a whole bunch of stuff that maybe we could... Oh, shit, that reminds me, actually. Can we actually barter with this guy and sell stuff? Because that might be useful. If not, we can always go back to the hub or whatever before we get started. What's up? Would you like to barter? He would like to barter. Oh, my God, he's got some stims, too. I could actually use these. All right, fine. We're going to trade him for two stims. Uh, we're going to trade him some of this stuff that we don't need. He has no caps, though. That's the only thing. It's a bit of a problem, actually. We got all of this cool stuff. Look, we got two knuckle dusters that maybe he would like. Which is still not quite enough. What about some booze? And what about some more booze? And how about a bottle of booze? And what about one of these two? Oh my god. Okay, and what about another one? Alright, fine. Tell you what. We just need these stims and we'll get rid of some of this garbage anyway. Let's offer that. That's a good trade. Okay. We, we lost some potential cappage there. But it doesn't really matter. We just need to get rid of stuff. Um, nothing by. We actually don't want to talk to anyone in here anymore, I don't think. I think we're pretty much done. Now that we got power armor, we don't really care. Do I need to, like, fuel this stuff up or something? Like, uh, power armor doesn't need, like, some fuel or anything? Or is it just good to go? Oh, man. <laughs> this, is, this is immensely satisfying. I really hope somebody steps to me. Oh, should we go um, back to the hub and do that high tower thing? We can't kill him, though, apparently. But can we kill all of his dudes? All his young dudes? That would be nice, actually. Um, and who was that for? It was the Thieves Guild, wasn't it? The Thieves Guild. Do we want to do that? Or do we want to, like, go back to the Glow? Or, like, we haven't even looked at the Boneyard before. Or the Cathedral. Do we want to go check them out? Maybe find some hints as to where the Master is? The uh, Jabba the Hutt-like figure that's out here hiding somewhere and is uh, gorging on people and absorbing their minds and just being a general sort of deviant from hell. I, I mean, I would love to go sock it to him, uh, if that's a thing. I don't even know. We're gonna have to check. Let's check out this boneyard. What the hell is this boneyard? There's downtown, there's a warehouse, and there's a ditem. Oh shit, yeah, a ditem. Los Angeles County, California, the playground of America. All right, what the hell is in a ditem? Does anyone remember what the heck is in a ditem? Let me quickly save my game after all of that traveling. Done. Hello, Aditum. I'm back. Watch yourself. I'm fucking Iron Man now. I'm not scared. Hey, Poochie. How you doing? Wanna... No? Who's this? What are you looking at? Nothing much. Looking at some scrub who doesn't have power armor. How can I help you, son? You have the look of someone important. Can you tell me a little... Oh, maybe we can try this? Oh, shit. Where can I find Zimmerman? Why am, why am I looking for Zimmerman? Does anyone know? You have the look of someone important. I'm Caleb. I trained and organized the regulator. Oh, shit. Oh, no. You have the look of someone important. Can you tell me what's the history bit? Where can I find Zimmerman? You'll find him in the big building to the southwest. He might be able to put enough sentences together to let you know that we're looking for some help with the blades. What's going on with the blades? They've done something to Zimmerman's half-witted son. But like I said, go talk to Zimmerman about it. All right, I get the picture. I'll go talk to Zimmerman. Okay. <laughs> I don't remember any of this, guys. I, I know that we've been here before, but I really do not remember anything about it. Who's this? It's Smitty. Good day. What can I do for you? I'd like to buy something. Can I ask you a few questions? Ask away. Where'd you get all your shop equipment? What do you... What all do you make here? Mostly I make the repair tools and implements here. I also fix things for the hub merchants. With the help of Miles, the chemist, I reload bullets from time to time. Oh. Can you make guns and bullets? Well, building guns and making shells takes machining, and I just don't have the tools for that. But with the help of Miles, the chemist, I can reload old brass since I can cast bullets. Okay. Well, bye. Thanks. Thanks for that trip down... Me memory lane? Possibly? I don't even know. Hi, are you new here? Yeah. Can you fill me in a little? 
I suppose. What do you need to know about? Uh, who are you? I'm Lorraine. Can I ask you a few questions? I suppose. <laughs> oh my god. Can you give me some information about the boneyard, please? This used to be a big city called Los Angeles, but the bombs hit really hard. Now there's just the Angels Boneyard. We added towners are just trying to survive in the wreckage. Can you tell me more about Los Angeles? Lots of people lived here. From what I hear, the survivors hid in a big place called a vault and came out years later. Oh shit, I'd love to find that vault. Some of them started the regulators and then founded a ditem, um, while the others formed the blades. The gunrunners aren't from here originally. Where is this vault? Well, supposedly it has some... It was somewhere south of here, but I don't really know really. I think everyone left because it was broken. Can I ask more questions? Um, what do you do for a living? <laughs> I'm a scav. I work with some mail to collect stuff from the ruins so that we can use it to build a trade. Why doesn't everybody here do that? Well, you got the death claws out there, plus the regulators take a percentage off the top, plus some for protection here in a ditem. Uh, guess people don't have the upfront cash or the guts to stare Deathclaw in the eye. I do. I've killed one. Um, it wasn't too bad, actually. I didn't even have this cool power armor on at the time either. What do you think of that? Can I ask you about some other stuff? I suppose, um... Tell me a bit about the other residents of Ditem. Who do you want to know about? Um, Zimmerman, I guess? Zimmerman watches over our town. He makes sure that everyone gets fed and that everybody has a job to do. Can we talk about something different? I suppose. Never mind. Thanks. <laughs> Bye. Wow. Lorraine was surprisingly helpful, actually. Holy shit. We might actually find some quests and stuff here, if you can believe that. I don't know if this is where we need to be, but let's just try it out anyway. Um, who's this? This is Miles. Oh, yeah. So you make bullets for a ditem. Where do you get your sulfur, potassium nitrate, and other chemicals? I'm surprised Mike knows about all of this kind of stuff. What other chemicals do you work with? Well, I've been trying to get some strong acids so that Smitty can use them for etching. I also have been trying to make some permanent dyes and inks, but without access to natural inks, it's difficult. Uh, where do you get the sulfur potassium nitrate? It's, un it's unusual to find someone who can appreciate chemistry. Well, I am a very smart individual. Uh, whatever your name was again. <laughs> but, oh, what, what was he going to say? But to answer your question, some of the materials we get from hub merchants, others I manufacture just find the area. For instance, the dung heaps from the Brahmin are a good source, as well as some of the strains of fungus that I cultivate. Thanks so much for that information. Anytime. Great. Wow. Well, I mean, at least these people are, like, kind of nice. I mean, better than most places. Stay in line. Okay, well, I take it all back. We don't get many outsiders here. Well, you got one now just happens to be dressed up exactly like Iron Man, and he's ready to tussle with anybody who looks at him funny. Hey, you, you want to look at me funny? Yeah, whatever. And some of these people are a little bit hostile, though, it's got to be said. We don't get many outsiders here. Um, what did they say? Southeast or southwest for Zimmerman? Who's in here, I wonder? And can we steal from this bookshelf? You think that that might be a thing? Zimmerman? Are you in here? Zimmerman, you- Oh! No, just, just open the door and he's there. Stark naked, staring at the door. Zimmerman, I didn't expect you to find you like this. And then he just turns around and says, This is my typical Tuesday ritual, friend. Please, embrace it. And then you sort of run away screaming like a girl because that is disgusting. Who's down here again? Oh, is this mushroom guy down here again? I think I remember this. Oh yeah, this was mushroom guy. All right, well... As cool as this is, it's also very creepy, so I don't really want to be down here. Um, is there anyone in this tent? Is there anyone southwest? Is he in here, maybe? Is he in this place, or possibly this one? Gosh, a ditem's not actually that big. I guess there's, like, the warehouse and the downtown area, too, which may be infested with... Hey, is this the room? There he is. Oh, yes, the mayor. What do you want? Your guard said you had a job for me. I might. Have you ever dealt with the vicious murdering band of thieves before? Uh, what is it out here? Is there any place in the wasteland that doesn't have a gang problem? Uh, uh you dealt with gangs before? Could say that. Um, I'm but underneath this armor. I am Ross Kemp. I've deeply embedded myself into gang culture, and I am ready to take on any gang you point me towards. You could say that. What's your problem, old man? I just said that I had, didn't I? I have no time for idiots. Get out of here. Oh, why did I pick that? What do you want? Your guard said you had a job for me. I might. 
Uh, the gang problem? You could say that. Good. Okay. We didn't screw it up. Good. Then you know how ruthless and bloodthirsty they can be. The blades are the worst of them all, I'm afraid. We're a humble, God-fearing town that is only trying to survive, and these... These monsters prey on us, he whispers under his breath. And our children. Yeah, yeah, that's great. What's the job entail, and what's it worth to you? What do you mean, prey on you? Well, the regulators keep them from attacking us outright, but it's all they can do to keep our little community safe. They try to sneak in at night to kill our citizens or to to kidnap our children, and he stops a moment to compose himself before continuing. Just last week, one of them burst through the north gate in the middle of the night with dynamite strapped to his body to blow up the regulators' barracks, no doubt to weaken us enough so that they could launch a full-scale attack. What happened to him? Luckily, the regulators killed him before he could complete his plan. I saw his body myself. I see. What would you like me to do about it? I'll give you two... Wow! 2,000 caps to kill their leader. I want that bitch's head. It's a girl? You seem to have something personal against her. She had my son kidnapped, tortured, and killed. They left him impaled on a post right outside the gates. Oh, okay. Well, uh, yeah. Those sick bastards, I'll take the job. Thank the gods. Finally, my son shall be avenged. The Blades camp is is to the north of here. Come back when you've done the job. Alright. Fucking the Blades. Alright, Blades. Where the hell are you? I'm coming to get you. Nobody kills a kid and puts him on a stake outside a camp on my watch. That's right. Iron Man is back in full effect. He doesn't want anybody acting like that out here in the wastes. Where could they be? The Blades? I'm coming to get you. Where are... Uh, is this the Blades hideout? Yeah, it is. It's a strong, stout man with a bushy beard. Okay, fine. Tell you what. No mercy. We're going in big time. Uh, or maybe we actually want to do a ho-ho-ho proofing on this one. Ho-ho-ho proof? Yes. Okay, fine. We'll switch to our fists of fury. And let's talk to this guy. And we're going to open up with a real cheeky line. Ready? Hello, lad. What might be you looking for today? What can you tell me about the blades? A good group of people is what the Blades are. Stuck here between the damn regulators and the Death Claws. Ain't meant the happiest life for them, but they survive. Alright, can I ask you something else? I. What else would you be looking to know? Who the hell are you? Well, I'm McCray. I help the Blades some against the Death Claws and that regulator bunch. Teach him a bit about protecting themselves against those nasties. Uh, where's my option to say, Good night, McCray. Or, time to... Punch your head right off your shoulders, McCray, or whatever. Because that's what I want to do. Um, okay, fine. I guess maybe... Can I ask you something else? Nothing. Alright, McCray. Maybe we can actually solve this in a civilized manner. Where is this woman now? Where's the leader of the... Oh, look at this. This guy's, uh... This guy's talking about all the stuff that the, uh, the old chemist needs. What the hell? These are all members of the Blades. Are all the members of the Blades just junkies? A very beautiful woman with a sad look in her eyes. That must be her. All right, fine, bitch. We're coming to get you. Why did you kill Zimmerman's son, you ruthless bitch? Can I help you? Are you the leader of this gang? Gang? We're hardly gang, but I'm the one they all come to for direction. Zimmerman sent me. Looking a little nervous. What? Did he? To put a bullet in your head? To pay you back for killing his son? What? Those fucking piece of shit bastards? I'll kill them. I'll send them all to hell. No. Uh, who are you going to send to hell? <laughs> this is kind of confusing. The regulators. They were the ones that killed Josh. I never would do anything to hurt Josh. It's the regulators who are running a ditem, not Zimmerman. This is a pathetic attempt, attempt to talk your way out of this. Why would the regulators kill Zimmerman's son? Josh lived here with me. Uh, I, I mean us. He knew the truth behind what was going on. The regulators told him if he had ever tried to contact his father or return to a ditem, that they would kill him. They laughed at him. They were so sure he couldn't get to his father. They killed him? What did he do? Late one night, he tried to sneak into the town to tell his father what was really going on. I was monitoring the regulators' radio transmissions that night. They... He caught... She looks down and shakes her head slowly. Here, it's all on this hollow disk. Why haven't you given this to Josh's father? It's not likely... It's not like any of us can even get close to Ditem. We'd be shot dead before we even reached the gates. Why don't I give him the disc? You would risk your life to help us? Well, I might. I need to go check things out before I do anything. Sure, anything to help. I'm not so sure it would help without the threat of violence to back it up. What we really need are some weapons from the gunrunners. Well, 
Where are these gun runners? Why don't you get some weapons from them? They're a little to the east of here, but there's a death claw nest between us and them. We have never even spoken with any of the gun runners. Okay. Give me the holodisc and I'll go talk to the gun runners before I approach Zimmerman. Thank you. This could really help us. Good luck. She hands you the holodisc. See you later. Whew. Man, holy shit. Talk about a quest. All right. We must look at this hollow disc before we give it to him because we have to make sure that we're not making a huge mistake by not punching this woman's face uh, in, caving it in in a major way. All right, let's check it out. Downloading data from disc, you gain 100 experience points. Okay, let's go into the old pepperoni and check to see regulator transmission. Here it is. Regulator transmission. Regulators radio transmission. Uh, I was just expecting the transmission to just have line after line of regulators mount up. But no, they actually say other stuff as well. Message sent. Regulator patrol to regulator base. Come in. Do you copy? Over. Message received. This is regulator base. Principal regulator Caleb responding. Report over. Sir, yes sir. Regulator second class Kravota reporting. We've apprehended the Zimmerman boy trying to infiltrate our perimeter again, sir. Orders over. Shit? Again? Well, that's the last time that's gonna happen. Eliminate him and make it look like the Blades did it. Understand? Over. Sir? Uh, did I copy correctly, sir? Kill him? Over? That's affirmative, Regulator. And I don't- and I want it messy. Impale him on the guard post up front. Oh, and cut out his tongue so he can't talk while we attempt to save his sorry ass. Over? It shall be done, sir. Over. And transmission done. All right, well, there we go. That's all the proof that we need. Okay, whatever your name is. Uh, very beautiful woman with a sad look in her eyes. We've got this, don't worry. We're gonna go find those gun runners, wherever they are. Is it to the east, we have to go through a death claw nest. Bah, that's no problem, we could totally do that. All right, we're gonna go through a death claw nest to get to the gun runners, um, who are probably people we don't even need to speak to because I don't even use guns. But let's look, let's just save in ho 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 proof anyway, just to be safe. And let's go kill some death claws. Oh shit, I think I have been here before, haven't I? Yeah, I have. I came through here one time and I was like shitting my pants, remember? I don't think I need to shit my pants so much this time. Cause look, I think I can just run right through. They're not even gonna see me. And then if they do see me, I'm fucking Iron Man, so who cares, right? I bet you these guys can't rip through my power armor. I bet you nothing can rip through my power armor. I've basically beaten the game at this point. Oh, shit. A big lake of toxic waste could be a bit of a pro- Whoa, is that Super Mario dead? No, it's just a dead body. It's not Super Mario's dead body. Uh, okay. So there's only one bridge in. Oh, that was pretty easy, though. And we should be able to speak to the gun run- Okay, it might be like a- What's the password? And we might have to be like, It's Mecha Hecka. Hi, Mecca Hunt. What is your business here? I'm just looking around. I want to buy some weapons. I need to speak to your boss. It is very important. Oh, okay. Gabriel will talk to you. Go on in. Okay, thanks. How did these guys run guns with all those death claws, like, in the way? Does anyone know? Holy shit. Man, these guys have a lot of barrels of toxic waste, don't they? They could totally do a Robocop on somebody out here. Oh, shit. Is this a dwarf? Is that a little dwarf? Gabriel? It's a gun runner. It's a typical gun runner. Another typical one. Another typical one. A large, well armed man. Typical gun runner. Typical gun runner, and a typical. Where the Christ is this guy? Who do I talk to? This dude? Hi, I'm Zach. You want me to buy weapons? Let me see what you have to trade. Um. Okay. I think I have some weapons I can trade him. Holy shit! This guy's got bazooka rockets and everything! Oh, does he have any of the stuff that I need? Oh, fuck, yeah, he's got a lot of it, too. Wow, okay. Uh, what can we trade him? We've got a whole bunch of stuff that we can trade him. And actually, we're sort of running a little bit low on power fist ammo as well. We could probably do with buying some of that stuff. Um, let me see. I have this for you. Uh, I have whatever this is. It's a key. It's an electronic lock pick. I should probably hang on to that. This is plastic explosives, a guy kind of radio. I got my rocket launcher, which I should probably hang on to because it might be handy. Uh, how about some of this Brotherhood armor? For six grand? Holy crap. Well, I don't really need it because I, you know, of course have the uh, power armor now. 
Four grand. Okay, what else can we buy from this guy? Holy shit, this guy's got... Whoa, he's got his own power. Wow, what is this? Spike knuckles. That's pretty cool. Uh, do we need anything else from here? I guess we could just, like, top the rest up with some caps. Might as well just grab, like, just shy of, what, 2,000 caps? Okay, we'll take 999 caps times one. And then let's also take, like, 980 caps, I think. 614. Oh, God, that was really close, actually. Just one more cap is all that's needed. There we go. How's this for a trade? All the ammo we could ever need, and then just like a bunch of awesome caps. Okay, that's a good trade. <laughs> Great. That's fantastic. All right. God, that worked out really well. Done. Okay. Who's this now? Nice day, isn't it? You betcha, toots. How about you? It's not often that we get visitors. How can I help you? Why don't you get many visitors? This place isn't very accessible with a nest of those damn death claws right outside our factory. You guys seem fairly well armed. Why don't you go exterminate them? We've gone over there and taken out a few, but they always seem to come back. Besides, we're machinists, not fighters. Um, what do you? What would you give me if I went in there and took care of them for you? If you could get rid of the death claws once and for all, you can name your price. Oh my God! I have some friends who can really use some of your weapons. Oh shit! Okay, so I actually have to fuck me. Jeez, this quest is pretty fucking epic. I mean, I have to, like, kill a million death claws now just to get these guys some guns to do this thing. Fuck. Okay, fine. I have some friends who can really use some of your weapons. You clear out the death claws, all of them, and you got yourself a deal. Okay, I'll do it. <sighs> all right. Just spin me around and point me in the right direction, and I'll just go in all fists punching. Man, Mike Tyson is ready for this, though. I mean, it's been a little while, hasn't it? We haven't actually had, like, a good tussle, sort of, like, all episode. We've just been running around talking to people. Mike is just, like, yawning his bare ass right off. He's just got... He's he's yearning for a good tussle. All right, fine. Tell you what. You will save. Ho, 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 proof, just in case. And we will go and sock it to all of these death claws. We're going to arm ourselves... And we're going to just go in all guns blazing. Let's see how much damage these things do. Oh, shit, there's two of them. No damage. Oh, my God. Oh, shit, we have got this. All right, to the eyes. Oh, my God. Holy shit, 48 hit points. Oh, oh fuck. Is he blind? 100 and... Oh, shit. Okay, that one actually did do a little bit of damage. And then no damage as well. All right, we have to get in close. That one, like, knocked me... For six, but still, we need three action points. Fine. I think we can do it with two. We need three. Okay, fine. I think I had it on reload, too, which is pretty dumb. Holy shit, this power armor is fantastic. Look, they do no damage. I'm, like, tanking two death claws right now. Okay, I had it on uh, reload, sadly, which is pretty dumb. All right. Man, these things can really take a goddamn beating. Man. Crap. Probably gonna waste, like, all my ammo on these guys. Three hit points. Missed. No damage. Missed. Okay, you knocked me down. Alright, fine. Am I getting, like, anywhere close to needing a stim? I doubt it, actually. How many of these things are there? I mean, two is enough, right? These things are crazy. Holy shit. It's getting me down. Twelve hit points. Feel the pain. Missed. Three hit points. All right, I tell you what. We don't have enough action points to use our inventory, apparently. How the hell is that? All right. One down. Fine. And we'll stim up. Probably. Should we stim up? Uh, we don't have enough action points to use our inventory. Again, for some reason. No. Okay, fine. In the eyes. Oh. Oh. Now we can use it. Great. Okay. Perfect. Let us get a couple of stims inserted into our butts. Oh, shit. You know what? I should have actually bought a bunch of these, but I just didn't really think of it. All right. We've got two stims. I mean, I don't think it's a problem because I'm pretty sure we'll be able to kill this death claw. No problem. Uh, and we want to also just punch him once. There. Okay. We hit it for 13 points. It hit us for two. What's with these knockbacks? God, luckily I've got my full football uniform on because I tell you what I'd be dead like in an instant without it all right a big one to the eyes and another one to the eyes we're not hitting him very hard but still 
hard enough. Oh my god, he's gonna kill me in a sec. Jesus Christ, what the hell? This, like, just took a real turn for the worst. Seven hit points, two hit points, five hit points. What happened to no damage? Is my power armor just, like, getting weaker or something? How come I can't blind this fucking thing? Serious wound is inflicted. Oh my god, this is gonna come right down to the wire. <laughs> Holy crap. We really need to take him out this time. Oh god, okay, finally. Alright, two death claws have been defeated. Oh shit, do you know what? Oh no, there's one more there. Okay, well we could probably rest up and hope that they don't come back. And also like have a little hunt around to see if there's any cool junk in here. What does a death claw even drop? Nothing. No dildos, nothing. Okay, great. What's this pile of tires? Why does it have like a little glow around it? I wonder if there's any good books here. These death claws have been guarding, oh, no books. What about in this desk? You gotta check all this stuff, don't you? There's a key! Oh no, there's just like a whole bunch of ammo and stuff that I don't really need. All right, fine. Uh, we should probably rest up and uh, maybe reload and do some other crap while we're here. This is just a table. All right, fine. Uh, let me um, reload. Now that I have, like, almost infinite ammo, and also, let us rest until we're healed. We can't rest at this location, apparently. Alright. Um, I wonder if Gunrunner Dude had some stims. I didn't even think to check, actually. We could really use some. I wonder if we can rest over here, and I wonder if I'm gonna have to kill those death claws again. Maybe the game won't let me do this. Pip. We can't rest at this location either, apparently. Oh, that is fucking crap, isn't it? All right, fine. We might have to, like, first aid ourselves into oblivion. Wow, great. Okay, first aid really paid off. At 102%, we healed for one hit point and another one. I mean, we're getting XP and stuff, but still. Maybe doctor ourselves? Well, that seemed a little bit better. Ten hit points, and we're probably mentally exhausted at this point. Okay, that failed to do any healing. You can't do that anymore because... You're exhausted. All right, that well, that works a little bit better. Doctoring and first aid at the same time. Holy shit, ten hit points. All right, well, it's better than nothing, right? Holy shit, look at all the XP I'm getting for this too. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, is fifty health enough to take on one death claw? Do you think? It might be. I'm just. They're back. <laughs> Fuck me. Come on. Or is that the one from up here? No, it's not. Holy shit, they just come back. Like, straight away. I can't believe it. Okay, fine. And we're not in range. How is he in range, but I'm not? That's kind of bullshit, no? Okay, to the eyes. Take that. 48 hit points. Did you like that? You, you mangy death claw? What about this one? For 14 points. No damage. No damage. He gets three hits. 12 hit points. We're gonna fucking die. Look, he's got backup, too. All right, I'll tell you what, we definitely need to go buy some stims. And we have to get away from this death claw before it kills me. I'm dead! I can't believe I'm gonna die out here to this. This is fucking bullshit. Oh my god, I did manage to get away. <laughs> I can't... Oh my god. You can't rest or anything out here. It's really difficult. Can you go this way? No, you can't. You have to go back through death claw valley. And I might not actually be able to get away. Hi! Uh, it's me, I'm back. Um, you may remember me from last time. What's your business here? I want to buy some weapons from Zack. Oh yeah, I remember, you're going in. Oh, phew, god. Wouldn't it have been such a shame if he was like, Hey, you can't just like, come here and then leave and then come back again? You're gonna have to go out there with 3 HP and fight all the death claws, you dumb son of a bitch. I wonder if- whoa, shit, there's a bunch of lockers there too. Who's this guy? Can't you see I'm busy? Busy doing what? Christ's sake. Zack sells the weapons. Zack sells the weapons. Get out of my way. Alright, let's see what this guy's got to say. Let's see if we can maybe, like, operate the forklift. No, he's not going to let us operate the forklift. Okay, Zack. I know I almost cleared you out of caps, but could really do... Uh, can you give me a discount? Okay. I hope it's not just guns he sells. I really hope he sells, like, other paraphernalia that I just managed to miss last time. Because we're pretty desperate for some stims and... Oh, shit. It's not going to happen. We can't rest here. We're going to have to try to sneak through the death claws to get to the other side. And do some, like... Okay, fine. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Nice doing business with you. Okay. I thought the power armor would, like, put me in good stead with, like, the death claws. And it kind of did. 
mean, I tanked two of them, and I managed to have, like, a really good tussle out there and stuff, but... They keep spawning back. You have to, like, Iron Man mode it. You have to, like, have a lot of stims, which I didn't have at the time. Um, and be ready for it. Okay, let's see. Let's try to work around this. If we can, we might be able to. We might actually just be able to walk right through without drawing too much attention to ourselves. Before we do that, let us just doctor ourselves probably one more time before he collapses into a heap of, like, mental exhaustion. Or first aid ourselves, possibly. Okay, we're all taxed out on the first aid. And we're all taxed out on the doctoring. Okay, fine. How about we just repair ourselves? Okay, we can't. Should we just science ourselves to make ourselves feel better? No? Okay, fine. We're gonna have to sneak. Alright, let's hope that in big clunky ass power armor we can manage to sneak around a little bit. Uh, which doesn't seem very likely, it's gotta be said. Okay, if we can just sneak in here without drawing the attention of these death claws, we can actually get through here. Oh, look, we can just get right out of here and we should be fine. So there's three death claws in total, or is there just two now to deal with? Because as soon as I get some stims, we've got this for sure. All right, we don't have to sneak now. We're making a run for it. Come on, Mike. Get running. Come on, what are you doing? Why are you stopping, Mike? Just run. Christ's sake. Jesus Christ. Okay, we're back. We're back in uh, a ditem, I guess. Is this a ditem? No, it's not. Where the hell are we right now? I don't even know. We're in the boneyard. Hey, what's up? Hello, hello. Where can I buy some stims? Do you guys know? It's the blades. Do you think the blades have like a... All right, we're gonna go back to a ditem is where we're gonna go. Um, and we're gonna try to find the uh, the shopkeeper. Cause these seem to all be like, gotta get back to work. What, work doing what? Just being a junkie out here? I mean, there's no work to be had out here for Christ's sake. Uh, okay, where is your, oh, it's this guy, isn't it? Is this the, this is the repair guy. So does that mean that there's like a shop guy in here too? Oh, for fuck's sake, Mike, would you just fucking, good God, fucking controls at times, seriously. All right, maybe down here, or was there nothing down here? We need to find somebody who's selling stuff, and I really don't want to have to, like, go elsewhere to buy stims and stuff. Can we barter with this guy? He's a chemist, apparently. Oh, okay, fine, four stims. That'll do. Let's buy all four for 470 caps. No problem. That'll do the trick. I offer you this. Great. Okay. And we, we need to heal up. I think we could do Thanks for the information. Done. All right. Who else could we possibly buy stims from, do you think? There's got to be someone else in here. Who's, like, in here and stuff? Stay in line. Don't worry. I'm planning on staying in line. Okay. I know that there's a line. I recognize a line when I see one. And I will totally stay in that line. No problem. Uh, maybe there's somebody in here who sells stuff. Maybe not Zimmerman himself, but... You know, maybe like this guy. It's a regulator. Oh, one of the guards of a Dida. We're watching you. I bet you are. You fucking regulators killed your own dude's son, you bastards. How could you? Okay, fine. There we go. Who's this guy? This is just fucking an inhabitant who doesn't want to talk to me. All right. Can I actually, like, um, rest here? I can. Rest until healed. Okay, perfect. With four stims and a full rest... I think we can take out these death claws, no problem. I feel like this is probably going to be a thing. I mean, to get fully healed, we have to literally rest for like 10 days as well. So maybe the death claws will be a little bit weathered by then. Or maybe they'll have all come back. Maybe there'll be five now instead of just two. Which would be total shit, actually. I would be pretty upset if that was the case. Fuck me. We done? Yeah, whatever. Fucking yeah, whatever you in a minute with my power fist, you son of a bitch. Just watch out, okay? All right, fine. We've come back here. We've rested. We've gained four stims from trading with the dude. Uh, and now we're going to go up here. And then we're going to hang a delicate right uh, to Deathclaw Town. And we're going to fucking sew this one up for all of the people. There's a conspiracy afoot here. And Mike Tyson is going to be the guy who gets in there and gets messy with the regulators and makes a name for himself all over the wastes uh, and continues to pursue also his um, the, the master because he has to for a quest. Man, Mike loves quests, doesn't he? Okay, so there's one death claw in view at least and there's two more there. All right, fine. We'll take on one at a time if we can. And before we do that, we're going to save as well, just in case. Because you never know. 
You never know these days. Okay, fine. Three death claws? Fine. Come on, you death claws. Give me your worst. All right, we're gonna switch and we're gonna get a couple of punches to the eyes. You think the eyes is a good one for death claws? Oh shit, yeah, that was good. 105 damage. Holy crap, 39 damage. He missed and he hit me for no damage and he knocked me over for 13 damage. And now I'm out of range. Fuck off. Fuck that stupid attack. There, take one of those. Uh, and while you're at it as well, take one of those. Two. Just a delicate little hit to the tushy. Okay. Fine. To the eyes. Once again. All right. Death claw down. Okay. So now we only have these two to deal with, and we'll have totally cleared them out. Whew. Okay. And I have 98 health. All right. I'm feeling pretty confident about this, actually. If I can, like, blind one of them, or even better, actually, if I could just... Uh, do I actually have any ammo left for the old rocket launcher? Because that would be hilarious. It would be hilarious to actually hit one with it uh, and kill one, but possibly... Do I have anything? We're about to find out. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. Did it aggro on me? Okay. We're out of ammo. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> I cannot believe it. All right, fine. Um, let's, uh, let's wait for them to come to me. Oh no, they're not going to come to me. All right, fine. We should be able to, like, isolate this one, hopefully, with any luck. No, we can't. Let's sneak up on it and punch it right in its derriere. Right, okay, the sneak did not work too well, actually. Uh, it's got to be said. But we should be able to punch this one in the eyes a couple of times. 54 hit points, great. We're off to a rock and start. 23. All right, we're surrounded now. Uh, but we don't seem to have lost any health there, which is great. 51 and... Whoa, 20. All right, we might have this. With 98 health... Uh, uh, sorry, no, 75 health and now 71 health, okay. So this, so the bullshit has started because obviously, I mean, I'm like a super tank with my power armor, but uh, you know, now they're like hitting me for, fuck off, come on, one hit point. This one's almost dead though, so that's good at least. I think one more hit to the eyes for this one and it's all, it's lights out. Yes, okay, fine, and another one to the eyes. All right, 48 hit points, holy shit, to the eyes. We're gonna blind this sucker, and we're gonna take him right out. Oh, crap, okay, fine. So I think if you kill all of them, they don't respawn. Okay, we're down to a delicate 46 health, but this guy's almost dead, I think. Okay, well, we cannot hit him now for some reason. And now we're down to 28, okay, well, we're almost dead now. <laughs> because for some reason we missed fucking twice. And now I don't have enough action points to fucking do shit. Okay, fine. To the eyes. Better be my turn. Where the fuck are all my action points? And how come I am dying? How has this fucking happened? <laughs> this is fucking bullshit. Jesus Christ. He got me down from, like, fucking full health. J this, just this one guy. Alright, fine. Here we go. We're gonna stim up in a major way. We're gonna use all of these stims. We're gonna blow them all because this guy is just cheating. Like, there's no tomorrow. Uh, and what do we do to cheaters? That's right, we give them drugs. Just like the old arcades used to say. Cheaters don't do drugs. Well, they do drugs when you ac accidentally force them upon them. That's right. <laughs> Fuck this death claw. What is this? The fucking big mama of all death claws or something? Can't fucking hit him in the eyes. Okay, finally, we hit him in the eyes. Okay, finally, again, we've hit him in the eyes. We're taking a couple of little hits for no damage. It's fine. We're gonna have to reload in a minute. All right, one more to the eyes. Finally! Oh my god, we got 2,000 XP for all of that too. Can you believe it? Holy shit, we're still in sneak mode for some reason. <laughs> I don't even know why. All right, fine. Back to the gun runners. I can't believe it. The power armor totally saved the day there uh, because we took so many hits uh, and some of it was a little bit suspect, like the whole knocking over and stuff. I, I took out two of them so easily, and then all of a sudden it was just, like, uh, very hard for some reason. I don't think this guy's going to appreciate the old bazooka coming into the compound. What do you think? What is your business here? Uh, I need to speak to Gabriel. It's very important. Yeah, I remember you go in. Okay, great. Holy shit. 
shit, I can't believe this is crazy. Um, 2,000 XP too, my god, we're probably gonna level up at some point. Okay, let me just quickly save, just in case there's like a ho-ho-ho moment or whatever that we need to like bypass, but we should be fine. We've killed all the death claws. we got the XP, we should be able to come back to this guy and say, Hey Gabe, guess what? That's right, three fucking death claws down, just like that. How goes it, my friend? I've been going okay. I think I've killed all the death claws. <laughs> We need to be sure we've killed over 20 in the past two years and they always seem to come back and we could never figure out how. Let's give it a few days and if they are still gone, we'll see what we can do for you. Okay, thanks. Really? <laughs> have to actually wait a couple of days? And I can't rest at this location? Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, fine. I'll just go back to town, rest, and I'll like, come back and... You're probably gonna be like, Well, I don't know what happened, but we're... Got another death claw infestation. I I don't quite know what we're gonna do this time, Mike. Um, get out there in your power armor with your power fist again, and take three of them out again. And are they back? Oh shit! Do you know what? I think this is looking pretty good, actually. Do we need to like find some eggs or something? Maybe there's like a whole bunch of eggs that we can squish to make sure that they don't come back. Cause I feel like that would be a thing. You know, maybe they've just left a whole bunch of eggs. Like, we'll look for a sewer hatch. Maybe they're down in the sewers just, like, mating and just being all disgusting with each other and, ugh, just having sex and, like, making a lot of eggs and st we have to go down there and, like, burn them or something? Do you think that that might be a thing? I mean, having said that, I don't see any eggs anywhere. I've had a really good look around, too, and there are a lot of dead death claws out here. All right, maybe this is like the game's way of saying like, get out of here and then um, so that we can like reload the area, make it on fire because they've been attacked by the regulators or something. Do you think that might be a thing? Can I rest here? Oh, I can. I can rest until I'm healed. Okay, this should only take about five days because I'm at like half health-ish. Oh my god. Does it have to recharge your hit points like in real time sort of thing? I mean, can it just skip forward? Like a couple of days and just leave it at that? Okay. How many days was that? That was at least a couple, right? It had to be. Alright, fine. I bet you I'm right. I bet you we go back and it's like, Oh shit, no. The regulators. They knew that you were working for us and trying to get the blades kitted out. Look, they're back. The fucking death... Oh, fuck off. How? I waited a few days, like he told me to, and they're back! Where do they keep coming from? Okay, we're gonna have to sneak by. We're gonna have to sneak by and talk to this guy, and he's gonna say that, right? He's gonna be like, oh shit, looks like, uh, looks like you have to get back out there and kill fucking million death claws again. I mean, it's good grinding though, right? 2,000 XP just for taking them out. I love this sneak. I love how he's sneaking around in like the chunky ass power armor that probably makes like robotic sounds when you're walking just like Robocop. Hey, Rick, what's that sound? I don't know. Just some dude in power armor sneaking behind them. All right, we're almost there. We're gonna go over to Gunrunner Joe's, but the whole place is gonna be on fire and everyone's gonna be dead. Okay? Mark my words. Oh, look. Where are the guards? Oh, no, they are there, actually. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why isn't anything straightforward in this game? Alright, I'm talking to you. What's your business here? I need to speak to fucking Gabriel again. About these fucking death claws. They've only killed 20 in two years. I killed three in one day. I think my ratio is much better. I think they should just hire me on full-time. Full-time death claw killer. You can be like the seagull guy where I live. Seagull sniper guy. Alright, fine. Let's see what he has to say. Well, how goes it, my friend? I think I've killed all the death claws. We need to be sure. Okay, thanks. Well, okay. So nothing is updated. I've been going okay. Let us know when you're taking care of... Yeah, see you around, maybe. Alright, great. Thanks for, um, thanks for letting me know exactly what I need to do. Again, game. Uh... Well, I guess we just have to like endlessly fight death claws until they they just run out or maybe I do have to find the eggs or whatever Jesus Christ. All right fine. Well, we'll be back um, To tussle once again with death claws and uh, try to figure out how to get these guns over to what's her face So that she can do that other stuff with uh, what's his face I'm kind of looking forward to seeing all that but I have no idea how to stem the flow of death claws So if you have any ideas 
let me know. Uh, I'm just going to be looking for eggs in the meantime uh, so that I can squash them or maybe set fire to them like in the movie Aliens or whatever. Uh, and that would probably be cool, but I'm not too hopeful about finding the eggs. It's probably some obscure like manhole cover, or some cave somewhere or something that has nothing to do with this place that'll like trigger the death of all death claws possibly, but I doubt it. But we'll see anyway. Great. All right. Well, as usual, thanks very much for watching and I'll see you next time.